Hey, what's going on, NFL fans, Atlanta Falcon fans? This your boy, Antoine Smitty Smith, Smitty Sports Machine. Y'all know I get down. Y'all know how to do it, man. Press that subscribe button. Also, press that notification bell. Get my videos as soon as I drop them. Also, press that like button. Help me get my videos through the YouTube universe. Greatly appreciated. But right quick, man, I got to get my quick thoughts on the Falcons uh, and what it seems like they're trying to do. Um, wide receiver position, man, is pretty deep. But after Kevin Ridley, after Russell Gage, um, do you really have a solid number three to – Really take over if they need be. Uh, Christian Blake has been here for a while, uh, but he hasn't proven himself as a solid receiver. Olam Olam Olamide Zacchaeus, um, he's another guy. Um, he's been in and out with his play, wasn't given the proper playing time, so we really don't know what to expect from these receivers uh, after Russell Gage and Calvin Ridley. So what I feel like Arthur Smith is trying to do, he's trying to find that wide receiver uh, that will come in with that chip on his shoulder, as I keep saying, because those are the type of players that he likes. Uh, but he's going to find that diamond in the rough in that gym, and he keeps searching and searching, just like a scuba diver going to the bottom of the ocean. Uh, but they worked out Cody Core, uh, formerly of the Bengals and the Giants. Um, he has 33 career catches, 388 yards, and one touchdown. Uh, six foot three, two hundred five. So he's a big body receiver. And if you notice what they've been doing over the last week, uh, looking at receivers, they're going for the big body guy. They lost that in Julio Jones, uh, so they're looking to replace him with that big body receiver on the outside. Um, not only Keelan Doss, uh, you look at uh, I'm sorry, not only Cody Core, but Keelan Doss, another uh, wide receiver, formula of the Las Vegas Raiders. He's another guy, only 25 years old. He's also 6'3", about 210. So they're going to keep looking for this big body guy to come in um, so they can have that advantage on the outside. Uh, because let's be real, all NFL teams should have a guy that can go up and make plays. Um, and to be honest, it really don't have to be a guy uh, that's famous. As long as you can catch the ball with two hands, uh, make plays, I think you have a shot on this team. Uh, and that's one thing I love about Arthur Smith. Um, he really doesn't go for big names. Uh, he can he knows how to coach them, but if he can coach anybody and get them to play to their full potential, uh, I think um, he's just that kind of coach. But you look at uh, when he took the job in Atlanta, um, he knew that Julio Jones wanted a trade, and he still took the job anyway because he was looking at the opportunity and not just the roster. Uh, because a great head coach can always make a roster that can be um, productive, um, that can be consistent, and that can win ball games. And at the end of the day, that's all you want to do. Uh, so, without Julio Jones moving over to Calvin Ridley, uh, Russell Gage, Christian Blake, and those guys, I think um, Arthur Smith will find a way to get this receiving core going. Uh, and even though the running game will probably be his signature on this offense and team's identity uh i think uh we'll see man we'll see but um keelan doss and cody core have worked out for the falcons in the last five days and they're looking for that big body receiver and i think in the end they will get it no one is still safe uh no matter whether it's week one week 10 week nine or whatever he's going to keep constructing this team until he puts the right team together. And this is the kind of mindset that you want to have as a coach. Always look for the best players. Always get the best out of your players. And this is what Arthur Smith brings to this team. Uh, so we'll see what he does, man. But those are my quick thoughts, man. Let me know what you think. Drop those comments in the comment box. Let's debate. Let's have fun as always. It's your boy Antoine Smitty Smith, Smitty Sports Machine. I'll holler at y'all later, man. Peace.